that's a shock to me. Like, I, I knew Packers were going to be in the free agent running back market, but I didn't think they would go big like this. And with them signing Josh Jacobs, that officially takes him off a lot of people's radar, especially the Baltimore Ravens. Josh Jacobs is literally a do-it-all running back. He does everything. He obviously can run the ball well, but he can catch passes out of the backfield. Uh, he can pass protect. He can do everything. Like, he... He's a do it all back. So the Packers are getting somebody who's extremely valuable and who they will obviously rely heavily upon. You saw how they used um, Aaron Jones. You saw how they used uh, AJ Dillon. You you saw the, the the Packers are a team. Like we saw this playoffs especially uh, against the Dallas Cowboys. They are a team that hey we ain't gonna be afraid to run the ball. We're not gonna forget just because we got a really good quarterback. And Jordan Love and Jordan Love is proven to be nice. Just because they got a really good quarterback, it doesn't mean like, oh, we're gonna shy away from running the ball. No. They want to make the job easier for Jordan Love, as they should. So Josh Jacobs heading to Green Bay. This is a really, really good move for them. A really, really good move for him. Uh, and it shakes up, continues to shake up that running back market that I thought would be a lot lower than what it's turned out to be thus far. These running backs are getting some bread. Now, I haven't officially seen the official numbers on his deal yet. Uh, still waiting on that, uh, but I'm sure it's going to be big because DeAndre Swift, he got big money. Uh, so you definitely would expect Josh Jacobs to get significant money as well.